Hey guys, and welcome back to another Random Distractions uh, gameplay experience where we're playing Batman the Telltale series. And in this one, we're going to try to see if we can figure out what happened that night uh, that Bruce's parents died. Assassinated. And Carmine Falcone knows why. Mm, interesting. ECPD, 8.56 a.m. Getting you in to see Falcone like this? I don't have to tell you how many rules we're breaking. <laughs> don't get me wrong, I'm always here for you, but this could land us both in hot water. I pulled all the strings I had with the lieutenant. This better not come back to bite us. Look, I get that hard, okay? And it means a lot to me. <sighs> I know it does, Bruce. It doesn't make it any easier. The last time we brushed shoulders with Falcone, the press made us pay. At least tell me what this is about. Look, mm -hmm. I just know what I'm getting myself into. I'm not sure, but I think Falcone put a hit on my parents. Wait, what? Bruce, that's that's terrible. That's why I have to speak with him. I have to know for sure. Bruce, I appreciate you opening up to me, but just try and keep it cool in there. I don't want any headlines taking away from my debate with Hill. Gentlemen, we finally put Falcone in his cage. Now, well, thanks to the information you gave me, Bruce, he won't ever get out. Whoa, I'm sorry. Uh, information? What information? Oh, well, I assumed you knew. I was going to contact your office first thing. I gave him some evidence against Falcone. Uh, more like a catalog of his entire criminal empire. It's a case that'll put Falcone away for life. Is that a fact? It's the reason I said yes to this unorthodox request. Nice job bringing in Falcone. Yeah, that son of a bitch better not get off again. He's not getting off the hook, Rene. Not this time. Mr. Wayne, Sergeant Rene Montoya. I just wanted to say, you know, some of us police support you, despite what the media is saying. Thanks, Sergeant. We're keeping Falcone in the infirmary. He's lucky he didn't get roughed up more. <laughs> I could tell Batman wanted to kill him, but he held back. He cares about doing the right thing. Whoever he is behind the mask, Batman's a hero to me. Yeah, it's great to know he's out there watching over the city. All right, Falcone's inside. You say what you gotta say. We'll be out here. All right, just gotta keep it cool. Episode two.
children of Arkham. The hell? Bruce Wayne? You must have some clout. My own wife can't get in to see me. <laughs> Good thing I'll be out of here in a week. <laughs> we need to talk, Falcone. You weren't so eager the last time we met. But then, I knew you'd come around. Especially after the press got their teeth in you. <laughs> You're your father's son. Yeah, that's right. Tommy and I were close. More than friends. More like cousins. Until you sent Joe Chill to kill him. Ah, so that's what this is really about, eh? The pop digging up a 20-year-old killer. Two killings, and they were never forgotten. You and me, we're practically family. I thought you'd have figured that out by now. Hey, I tried to get through to your dense party. Maybe I should have spelled it out. We are not family, Falcone. I'm nothing like you. If you're anything like Thomas Wayne, then we're not so different. Your father, Hill, and me, we ran this city. Still do. <clears throat> God damn this pain. Can't think through it. Morphine's on the side there. Be a good boy and... Help Uncle Carmine out, huh? <laughs> oh, all right. I not here to take care of you. You deserve to suffer for what you've done. Of course. You'd never know the truth. How much of your old man is in you? I need you alive. But only until I have answers. Apple didn't fall far, did it? You got that Wayne seed. He loved you, you know. He did it all for you. Hmm. He protected his own. But if you got on his bad side... Your father was more ruthless than any of us. He had a switch, you know. Still, made us all rich, including you. Some people just have the mind for it. He was one of the most brilliant men I ever knew. Until you hired an assassin to take him out. What, you really think I ordered the hit? Sure, I worked with Joe Chill from time to time. Put a button on someone, he'd take him out. But I never ordered that hit on your parents. So who did? You can't trust anyone in Gotham. Least of all those you call friend. Your parents learned that. Oh no. Who shot him? I'm waiting for you in hell! The bastard had to die! <sighs> What's wrong with her? Hands in the air! Stand down! Get a doctor! Secure this floor! No one gets in or out! Go! Go! Hmm. Well, there goes that headline. GCPD, 1022 AM. some time but not much or it's gonna get out sooner or later why would she do something like this we had gotham's biggest crime lord in our grasp i don't i don't know i hardly recognized her when she burst in she was so different from the woman we met in the hall <sighs> it's a disgrace another officer gone rogue it just doesn't make any sense She'd never do anything to hurt the department. Oh, Falcone's case meant justice for a thousand unnamed victims. And now it is a PR disaster. 
How can I run against corruption when our own cops are redecorating the precinct with their prisoners' brains? Listen, we gotta get out in front of this. We gotta spin it as best we can. Issue a statement saying that we have the shooter in custody. That details are still coming in and that we're investigating. The, the usual. Slow down, Harvey. We need the facts first. The simple fact is she walked in and shot him. Then we need the complex facts, like how and why. Lieutenant, uh, Mr. District Attorney, uh, Falcone's lawyers are here. Oh, Christ. I can delay them for a little while. We still need answers. Tell me if she says anything. I have to know why she did this. Alfred, Falcone's been murdered. Good God. I'm looking into it, but I'll need access to the back computer for anything I find. Connection secured. Alfred, I'm gonna try and confirm some suspicions of mine. Her veins. Mm-hmm. Oh, looks like maybe she was. Yeah. That doesn't look like blood. Alfred, I think I found the substance. Analyze and forward me the result. Of course. I'll be in touch as soon as I have the results. Where am I? Mr. Wayne? What's going on? Oh, but I got this awful feeling something terrible happened. Sergeant, you have to think. What do you remember? Oh, God. Falcone. I was hoping it wasn't real. I believe you were drugged, Sergeant. I... It would explain a lot. Listen, you have to believe me. I talk big about hurting thugs like Falcone, but I would never, never betray the lieutenant. Everything is so foggy. I remember a sharp pain. There's an injection site on your neck. Then I just felt light, like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt, no consequence. Hmm. There was a voice in my ear insisting Falcone was gonna get off and all I knew was that I had to stop that I had to no matter what you have to remember more Montoya try I remember a hand on my arm guiding me like a parent with a child the voice it was saying something about revolution oh hmm Cobblepot said something similar. I'm so sorry, Lieutenant. I've let you down. We stalled Falcone's lawyers for now, but they'll be back. How is she? Did she tell you anything? Yeah, hey, 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 don't worry about that now. I found evidence that she was drugged. A fresh injection site on her neck. I was out of my mind, Lieutenant. Please believe me. Hey, I do. Of course I do. Hey, get forensics in here. Now! She remembers a voice saying something about revolution. That's not much to go on. Now, if you're bringing forensics in, let's get Bruce out. Alfred, I gotta get back to the manor. I've got a lead on whoever's behind this. Bruce! Oh, boy. <laughs> what are you doing here? My friends in the in the GCPD have been telling stories about some kind of lockdown. I, I'm I'm sorry, Vicky. I, I don't have time. Don't brush me off. Word is there were shots fired near where Falcone was being held. Know anything about that? I mean, you must have been back there when it happened. Where did you get that? So it's true. <laughs> no, I didn't say that. Word is you turned over enough dirt on Falcone to put him in Blackgate Prison for life. A day after he showed up at your house. 
Well, now you're here. You can't afford to be associated with another scandal. I can keep your name out of whatever we print, but you need to give me something I can use. Who fired the shots? A, a cop? Mm. I can tell by the way you're brushing me off that something happened. Just give me something to run with. A police sergeant, the name Montoya. W wait, Sergeant Montoya? You didn't get this for me. Hmm. I don't know if that was the right choice, but I did it anyway. All right, I'm going to go ahead and stop it there, guys. Uh, thanks again for joining me for another random distractions uh, gameplay experience. Yeah, these uh, decisions are starting to get like, oof, you know, uh, harder and harder, at least the, compared to the other one uh, or the last one. Um, but... Yeah, so, but it's still really good. It's still really good. So I uh, would definitely appreciate a like and uh, make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you know when the next one drops. And until then, hope you have a good one.